Good enough some tire pads down. It ain't that hard to get it done. Just tell them what you want. And they put the pressure in the tire. That's all it is. Something simple like that. So there he go and check it. Press the buttons on the thing. So how did this tire pads work? I'm making a uh, YouTube video. What do you mean? How, so how does it work? Like what do y'all have to do for it to work? You just type in the numbers on here. Uh-huh. Take it up there. It's a one-way air system. So one-way one air doesn't take away air. Okay. If it's 20 pounds below what you want it at, it won't air it up because of risk of run flight damage. Okay. So if it's 20 pounds under what I want, it won't air it up because of what? Run flight damage. Run flat damage. See, it airs it up to what you want it at when it starts flashing. So it's flashing like that. I wait till you put the other one on there. See how it's flashing? It got enough air in it. It got the air that I want in there. And somebody left the, uh, the cap. Oh, yeah, Tire pressure cap. And both of these back here on this side, good? Yep, this here's about 117. Okay. I think technically they say what, 120 on the side wall? Yeah, well, that's max. So yeah. once you start driving and whatnot, it'll expand. Yeah, but that's max for cold, 120. Okay. Right? Max 120 PSI cold. So I can have it at 120 like this here because I just started driving. I ain't even drove yet. At least from parking lot. This parking spot is right here. I wouldn't recommend it, but you could. Nah, I don't. I go 110 and 105. Put that 110 because you had the other two at 110. So that way we keep, up, right? Yeah, that way we keep all of that the same. So ladies and gentlemen, after they put all the air pressure the tires, they got this little gauge that they put on there to read the tread there. Uh, he'll show you that gauge if you got it with him or not. But they'll put it on there and read the tread depth. And after they read the tread depth, go inside and grab a piece of paperwork. He'll let me know where I'm good at, what tires I need to change or anything like that. And then that'll be that. But you can only get that tire, that tire pass at Love's. That's the only place I stop and get fuel anyway. I don't stop nowhere else, you know, unless I absolutely have to. Anyway. It's uh, Stu's Logistics signing out. Y'all have yourself a good day.